These are the top 10 things you should be buying at Aldi this July 2021. Welcome back to the channel. I'm the YouTube deal guy, Matt Granite. Oh my goodness, I know I don't get out that much, but I could not believe it was just put onto store shelves at my local Aldi less than 24 hours ago. You've come to the right place. From air conditioners and dehumidifiers at impossibly low prices to frozen lemonade bars, enchilada bowls, how $5 can help you bake almost anything in your toaster oven, I am here. So let's begin with the first round of products First, a double beverage dispenser. And I bought this and I took it home. $19.99, again, gets you two of these very well made. You could have a kids and an adult beverage dispenser. You could make kid friendly products in one. You could make the iced tea and bubble tea that I like in the other, lemonade, sangria, you name it, at 10 bucks a piece. I am smiling all the way to the bank. The Belgian waffle maker that you see right here, $14.99. If I had to compare this to what I have found available from comparable brands like Dash, you're definitely doing well on something that appears to be very well made. If you do have a craving for Belgian waffles and bargains, this would be something you might want to grab. Also at under 20 bucks, like almost every item on this list, the folding utility crate that you see here on wheels is great not only for entertaining and serving, but also a great way to serve as storage and transport things from room to room. Could have totally used this between the nurse and children's toys for what we have in our home, but different ways you could use this in your home entertainment room. I, I just like it. In the number two spot of what you should be buying at Aldi in July before I get to sunglasses, lighting, kitchen items, and the AC units, the food selection, phenomenal. The range of hummus flavors particularly strong this month, spicy, olive, garlic, red pepper, $2.49 and some beautifully fresh, authentic flavor combinations. The fresh cut salsa, mild or medium, and I will say the medium does have a little bit of bite to it, $4.49. Spreadable cheese varieties coming in at under three bucks, the goat milk cheese logs. I don't think cheese log is a particularly tasteful term, but unlike the rounds of cheese, this is a whole log. Have a whole log of cheese for $3.59. The avocado dip and spread. If you are not a guacamole fan, you might like the avocado spread because it's smoother. And if you are a guacamole fan, well, who doesn't want more avocado? In the dip form at $4.49, a consideration. The vanilla maple whipped cream topping. Oh, yes. My wife loves whipped cream. Who doesn't? I love her. $2.89 and you can get some maple into the mix. The shredded rotisserie chicken that you see right here, as well as the white wine pepper chicken options. $5.49 or $5.99. The birthday cake rice crispy treats. Also a great camp snack. My three-year-old just started going to day camp. This is something that won't melt in the heat. It's a relatively nutritious treat, kind of, but it tastes just like the real thing, although this is an alternative brand. And the almond butter filled pretzels. If you are a snacker or more importantly trying to up your snack game, $4.99. Again, almond butter filled pretzels, delicious. In the number three spot of what you should be buying at Aldi, did you know you could get surprisingly good sunglasses for under nine bucks? The ones here are $8.99. And while I realize these are more than what you would find at Dollar Tree, if you've ever watched some of my prior videos, these are huge polarized sunglasses that offer both UVA and UVB protection. So again, for $8.99, if you're someone that's typically clumsy or you lose them or you sit on them all the time, I would never want an expensive pair of sunglasses. The magnetic fly screen at $14.99 cents, definitely a seasonal item you might want to consider. And I think this is again, something I wish I had about a month ago. I should interject quickly and overshare some information. Every year we seem to have a fly infestation in our home at the end of August, right before September. They set up these nests and seem to lay eggs right where the exhaust from our laundry machine is, you know, those vents that hit the exterior of your home. So they, they just love it in there, but don't worry. I figured out what to do this year. And anyhow, $14.99 might be something you want to consider. The LED curtain lights, $6.99. So these are more of the lights that you can hang from doors. They're certainly not the Govi lights that you can control with a smartphone, but they're meant to add a little bit of ambiance. Technically, these could work as canopy lights, depending on how many you buy. And the LED string lights that you might see all over social media, people put these into vases or vases, depending on how you like to pronounce it, $3.49. Before I get to a huge selection, Collection of kitchen items at some prices I just couldn't believe based on the quality. And the number four spot of what you should be buying at Aldi, the laundry basket that you see right here, $6.99. And while size sometimes matters, as I like to tell myself, it certainly matters big time for laundry baskets. 
And at $6.99, this is a full-size laundry basket available in two colors. Great for a student apartment, a dorm room, but given the quality, you could buy one for yourself, one for a kid off to college. So many different ways to make this work. The Moscow Mule mugs that you see right here, $4.99. Definitely one of the more trendy summer beverage related items. And who doesn't want an insulated wine cup? $5.99, kind of like a hydro flask for your wine so you can just walk with your wine wherever you want. Although I'm well aware there are stipulations of just filling up your insulated wine cup and taking the dog for a walk and walking down the street or going to the park. Maybe if you got a really big backyard, you could just walk around with your wine all you want. And the number five spot of what you should be buying at Aldi, I did a bit of a high five there, you can tell I like the kitchen products. The huge selection begins with the Comfort Grip Utensils. $3.99. If you guys are familiar or frequent Aldi shoppers, you might have seen the mini utensils earlier this year. I think it was March. These have the mini price tag, but these are the full-size comfort grip utensils. I like the variety. I love the quality. The 24-count mini cupcake pans you see right here, these were advertised as summer cupcakes, which is strange branding because I think you could eat mini cupcakes all the time, not just the summer. $7.99. Now, the next trio of products are tied to turn your toaster oven into more of a conventional oven. I guess the draw might be it's easier to clean, less of an energy draw, doesn't heat your whole home. If you just have a toaster oven, well, all the power to you. This mini baking pan for your toaster oven, five bucks. And this mini cookie pan for your toaster oven, five bucks. Which brings me to this question, which you're of course welcome to leave a comment on. Do you use your toaster oven to bake? Would you ever make cookies in your toaster oven? And I've definitely seen more toaster oven pushes, Wi-Fi toaster ovens, things advertised all over the place. So maybe it's a big return of the toaster oven that I'm not yet aware of. Anyhow, and well before the Thanksgiving transportation food rush, these glass meal prep containers, which are oven safe, give you the option of one large meal prep glass container for $7.99, which could hold a big, thick lasagna, casserole, whatever you're known for in your family, you can now transport this from point A to point B. You can also buy a mini version of the exact same thing in a two pack for also that same price of $7.99. The eight piece round glass containers, great for food storage, $9.99. And one of the products that I never knew I wanted until I started making hamburger meat from scratch and meatballs in my home, meat molds, $7.99 as well. Meatball, slider, or hamburger molds to ensure that you get the perfect size rather than trying to compress them with a spatula or making the mess that I have in my kitchen frequently before I barbecue. You could just get that perfect form that looks like it came out of a package, except you controlled all the ingredients. The fruit slicer that you see right here also has two different options. You could get the giant melon slicer or the mango slicer, which has multiple fruit slicing attachments tied to it for $9.99. Who's getting hot from all this talk about meat and cooking and food? Or maybe it's just because I'm overheated. If you've noticed, my face looks a little bit more like an oil rig today, and that's just because I'm amped up. In the number six spot, something that I should probably add to this room, a portable air conditioner. And take a look at the price on this 8,000 BTU unit that's also a dehumidifier. $199.99. So guys, this is the non-window air conditioner. It's freestanding. It has the exhaust hose that you put out your window. And $200 for an 8,000 BTU portable AC unit is phenomenal. This portable air conditioner unit is made by Aldi's in-house brand. And I always find that there's a fantastic level of quality tied to many of their home products. To put this price into perspective, right now on Amazon, there's a Black & Decker 5000 BTU portable air conditioner, which will handle significantly fewer square feet for $398. If you don't need a huge air conditioner, you just need reinforcement on a nightstand, or if you just want to see if one of those portable air conditioners that you've seen advertised in your social media feeds is worth it, you can score one for $19.99. I brought this one home to test. You put the water in. Instead of expelling the hot air through your window, you can drain it. It's a great concept. I don't think it's worth more than 30 bucks as many of the competing products seem to sell for. But at $19.99, I'm happy I bought it. It would provide great reinforcement on a nightstand and an office. And it is certainly great for sweaty sleepers like myself. That's probably too much information again. But if you don't want to go the whole portable air conditioner route with LED, the five inch USB powered fan that you see right here, $7.99. Again, USB power, great on the go. You could even attach this to a power bank and that would work beautifully. Plug it into the DC adapter in your car if your air conditioning's gone out. You can also find many home dehumidifiers at Aldi for under 10 bucks this month. These are not mechanical, they're chemical free blocks that will absorb a lot of moisture in the air. So if you have a basement office or bedroom, an area of your home that needs a little bit of help, $10 could go a long way.
in the number seven spot before I show you a smartwatch that I brought home and tested purchased from Aldi. Let's begin with the Outdoor Loungers. This $29.99 beauty is foldable. It has a portable sunshade, great for tailgating the beach, a lake home, put it by the river, however you make this work. Even for your backyard, it's great for taking in the sun. The Gladiator Jousting Game that you see right here, $18.99 inflatable. Great, so you and another member of your household, particularly kids I would imagine based on the sizes of these products, can joust against an opponent and feel good about it. The 5-in-1 Outdoor Game Pack that you see right here includes ring toss, badminton, frisbee, volleyball, and some take on a game that looks a little bit like lacrosse, $19.99. Giant Topping Blocks, AKA Jenga with a non-licensed name, $29.99. Wonderful for inside or out family game nights. The watertight smartphone case that you see right here, $4.99, a way for you to keep your most valuable pieces of tech safe if you are out on a boat, by a pool, a completely watertight seal. And again, for five bucks versus the cost of replacing your smartphone, I am definitely on board for one of these. The pool float speaker that you see right here, available shaped like a unicorn or a flamingo. I, of course, opted for the flamingo, and while I don't own a pool, my parents do, so I did test its audio quality on carpet. It is waterproof, it floats. The audio quality was decent for $9.99, though. This is definitely something I would put in a pool or a bath without thinking twice. And a premium 17-piece grill set for $24.99 includes tongs, spatulas, corn holders, really anything you would need to up your grilling game and have a much higher quality than anything you would see at Dollar Tree, Family Dollar, Five Below. I was happy to find this. In the number eight spot of what you should be buying at Aldi in July, some crazy tech finds, then I'm gonna go back to some of the best desserts I have seen in months. Let's begin with this UV phone sanitizer, a great way for you to clean your phone for $18.99. You could also put car keys, perhaps a small remote control for your television, Bluetooth headphones, pens, brooches, whatever it is that you need to clean, 10 minutes does the trick. There is also an option to infuse this with an aroma of your choice. I always find that a little bit odd if you wanna make your smartphone smell like lavender, but all the power to you, $18.99. The Gleam battery powered toothbrush, a fraction of the price compared to what you would pay for an Oral-B or a Sonic toothbrush. It doesn't have a wireless charging case, it doesn't have an app, but it does have a nice design and a price of $16.75. If that's a little bit steep for you, the Dentaguard toothbrush, which is a significant off-brand discount, $4.99 also includes a replacement head, probably better than a traditional toothbrush and at under five bucks. Might as well give it a shot if you are someone that doesn't want to spend a lot of money but wants a better clean. Now this iTouch smartwatch for $49.99 is not anything I would ever recommend unless I was able to purchase it, bring it home, and try it out. This is what I can tell you. The resolution, the screen, and the features, obviously not on par with a Samsung or an Apple watch, but at under 50 bucks, it's a fraction of the price. It does have a heart rate monitor and a pedometer that both perform. You can sync it for your social media alerts. I was not unimpressed. And if you just want to dip your toe into the smartwatch world, this will pair with both iOS and Android devices. I was surprisingly impressed, which is why you'll find this on my list. And finally, this wireless mouse and mouse pad set, $12.99. Great if you do need a replacement, good for back to school, and other ways to make this work for a home office. In the number nine spot of what you should be buying at Aldi this month, buckle up for a hunger. I don't even know if that's a thing. There's so many good food items, I'm gonna move through this quickly. If you like pizza, oh, get excited. First things first, the frozen food and desserts. The avocado chunks that you see right here, $2.99. I heard from some of you that didn't quite like this alternative available at Costco. This is a significantly lower price. I have heard they are well rated. I have not tried these. The M&M ice cream cones. My daughter loves the cone more than the ice cream. All the power to her. $3.89 for the M&M ice cream cones. The M&M sandwiches, perhaps more my jam at $3.47. Delicious. The frozen lemonade bars that you see right here, you get a four pack for $2.49, which is roughly 62 cents per frozen lemonade bar. And you can bet I was intrigued, so I not only purchased this, but I did not wait before I got home to consume this in my vehicle. Flavors include lemonade, pink lemonade, and I indulged in the strawberry lemonade combination. Delicious, refreshing, and you can actually taste and enjoy the real pieces of fruit 
Definitely a consideration at this price. The frozen fruit bars as an alternative, you get a four pack for $2.35. I did have an employee in Aldi come up to me and tell me I should also put those into my shopping cart. This six pound box of beef patties at $14.99, fantastic value. And if you're not a beef eater or you just want to also score this eight pound box of chicken breast at that same price, I would grab both if you have an appetite. The chicken or pork enchilada bowls at $2.99, perhaps not exactly on par with what you'll find at a Chipotle, but hey, it's under three bucks and you can control your amount of protein. The huge frozen pizza selection this month, better than anything I have seen in prior months at Aldi. Too many flavors and concoctions to mention, but there is a Euro pizza, a Cuban branded pizza, the Mama Coatsy Barbecue Beast Mega Meat Pizza, Five different types of meat, heck yes. I also found Greek style pizzas, a five mushroom pizza, and a whole range of cauliflower crust ready pizzas that you can grab at Aldi this month. Before I get to the number 10 spot of what could be the most trendy items available at Aldi this month and some really cool bonus buys, if you guys do like this content, please feel free to give this video a thumbs up. It helps with my developing level of self-esteem and more importantly, the YouTube algorithm. If you want to share this with a fellow Aldi shopper, I really do appreciate it. Now I purchased this next product from Aldi because I've seen them advertised everywhere. They're very difficult to find in stock on Amazon. They are the bug repellent food fans. So essentially a canopy fan to protect your food from bugs. Great for patio season, for hosting. If you have any members of your household that have a fear of bugs or just don't want insects in their food or the buzzing and other levels of discomfort that might accompany insects, this is a tremendous buy at $6.99. The queen bed with air pump, $24.99. I don't think I've seen a price like that attached to such a product ever this year. The portable tire inflator for $16.99 are always significantly more popular around the winter driving season months, but to score it in stock at this price, perhaps a consideration. And the trunk organizer with cooler, Take a look at this bad boy, $12.99. This was yet another product that I picked up on my Aldi shopping spree, and I was very impressed. This would work with pretty much any trunk and a better way to get organized for future trips to Aldi and beyond. Now, for the bonus section of this video, some of these picks are a little bit more eclectic, and some of these have a reason why they didn't make my conventional top 10. Let's begin with the stroller phone holder, $4.99. It's a bonus item because not all of you have kids that you're pushing around in strollers, and of course you wanna keep your eyes on your kid and not your phone. It's a good way to dock your phone if you are using your phone to play lullabies or perhaps for limited screen time for someone that may need a little bit of calming down. I don't know, under five bucks, maybe there's a way to make it work. The 55 inch kids trampoline that you see right here at 80 bucks has an enclosure. It does look a little bit like a cage, but perhaps a safer way for your kids to jump with adult supervision. Minions are so popular, they are on my daughter's toothbrush they appear to be everywhere and they are now at Aldi in the form of Minion Nuggets, $5.79. Clearly a bonus item for many of you, but would be in the number one spot in my household if a certain someone had their pick. The electric pressure washer at $99.99 is a bonus item because I only saw one at my local Aldi and I do not know if these are widely available for everyone watching right now. So I didn't wanna set you up for disappointment if you can't find it. I've also not tested it, so I cannot comment on its performance. The memory foam bath mat, also a little bit of an eclectic pick, but $9.99, perhaps this could work in your household if you enjoy a good bath and a little bit of memory foam stability. And the embroidered straw tote at $19.99. I'm just adding this in the event you wanna bring a little bit of personality to your next picnic, your beach trip, even a shopping trip at a warehouse club. These bags include uplifting sayings like, slay all day, life's a beach, and rosé all day. Clearly fun and clearly bonus picks as part of this, what you should be buying at Aldi in July 2021 roundup. Thank you so, I don't know why I'm waving now. You can just, I'm like, yes, we got there. Thank you for making it to this point of the video. If you guys like the content, please feel free to subscribe and turn your notifications on. In one of my upcoming videos, not too far from now, I'm gonna celebrate the, the top buys that you can make for under 20 bucks on Amazon or under 25, depending on what I end up testing. I have saving secrets for Costco, Sam's Club, Dollar Tree. It's all here. And if you guys want to join my insider deal guide texting club, feel free to send me a message. My phone number to do that, 440-298-2181 to get on that list and never miss another deal. Thank you so much for being here. 
बाय बाय